One of the things I've learned traveling around, speaking to college students, adults, professionals, leaders, is that we're not doing what we love. And what do I mean by that? We're not living with passion and purpose. We've been stuck in the same career over and over. We're a rat in a wheel and we get trapped in it. A lady actually came up to me at one of my presentations during a leadership conference and she was, had tears in her eyes. She said, I realize I've wasted my life away doing a job that I hate for the money. And really it starts with passion and purpose. I believe the fundamental thing, if we discover our passion and purpose in life, then we can change our families, our neighborhoods, generations, governments, worlds, and it really begins at the heart of purpose and passion. How we discover that, what angles can we take to get there, and how do we do it? And not to take life for granted. We know, and there's debates about it, how old the world is. Two to three billion years old. And we spend a majority of our life doing work we hate we don't have much time on this earth. Life is finite and there's changes and things you can do in your own personal development in your own career development can, to begin that change. So I often tell people to live their life inside their dash. And what does that mean? So I met, was able to be inspired by this little girl who discovered her passion she lived from 2000 to 2008. She lived inside her dash, a very short window of time. And you think about it, no matter how long you live, your life is as short as a dash. You don't have that long. It's literally like a star in the sky. And what you do in between that small dash is gonna determine how you feel later on in life and it's going to determine whether you've inspired generations to change, if you've left a legacy, and if you built your communities. And I was inspired by her because she lived literally eight years in the world. She had neuroblastoma and she passed away. But she discovered her passion in life that it was to help people that were discouraged. 